Hi, I'm Shelly LeVette with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you stamp and cut. This is excellent for fine motor development as well as developing scissor skills. You'll need to have paper strips and you can either use cardstock paper or regular paper. This is cardstock paper. It's thicker to cut and I have mine in a little over an inch wide strips but you can determine whatever length you would like to use and I have, just have those sitting in a basket. You need to have scissors and you need to have, to have something to stamp your strips with. We just used um, paint daubers on ours and these are just, um, found them in the Michael's Craft Store. They're called Kids Paint, they're shimmer, and they're scented so they smell really good. The children really enjoy using these. But you can use regular stamps with a, a ink pad and a stamp or, or if you have any bingo daubers. Anything that works fine that'll create a mark on here, which is what you want to do. Um, for younger children, you may want to have these already um, done. They just went along and did um, put six dots on here. They can choose whatever color they want, but they are told that um, to try and leave spaces in between the dots because they'll be cutting in between theirs. And so that's the first step is they take plain strips out of this basket and then stamp on them with whatever you're using to stamp. We just used our daubers and then they'll put them in this basket and then at um, when they're done with that part then they're going to take their scissors and then choose one out of the basket choose a strip out of the basket you should have something to put the paper strips into we use usually a bucket or a bowl so they would choose a paint strip or not a paint strip um, one of these strips here they have our our dots on them and then they just cut in between the dots on here they don't have to be perfect. The dots, if the children are doing them, the, these dots won't be evenly spaced and that's fine. All you need to have is a space in between to cut the paper. They really like this activity. It's simple to do, simple to set up, but it works on um, a couple different skills for them, fine motor and scissor skills on here. And so they can do as many as they want. So it's up to you how, you know, maybe one day or um, one week work on making the dotted sheets here uh, or stamping the sheets and then doing the cutting activity later or you can just have maybe choose three strips out of here and then that's the way we do it is to choose three and then stamp them with your paint or your stampers and then they would cut them after that and they're free to go back into more later as well. So for Stamp and Cut, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com and thanks for watching.